All right, so one other piece of information you're gonna need from uh, in order to set up the beta test on tracking sheet. So before we just needed listing data and sales data, we've added one more tab. It's way over on the right, so you can hit the arrows and, and get over there. It's called disposals and removals. And what we've done now is if you've removed your inventory or disposed of it, paid to have it sent back to you or paid Amazon to destroy it on your behalf, we've now tracked that. So it actually gives us a much more complete picture of your inventory's life cycle. Uh, I'm actually really, really pleased with how this turned out. So the way to get this report from Amazon is to go over to reports and then click on fulfillment. You're gonna pop up with this page. It's where you can find your inventory health report. Well, way at the bottom, you're gonna see removals and then removal order detail. It'll pop up like this. You wanna go over to the download page and then it, uh, we're gonna set up exact dates. Just go back as far as you think you have data. That's not gonna let me type it in, maybe it will. So go ahead and triple click that. 01, 01, 2014 through like yesterday. You can't go through today, otherwise it, it won't run the report because it waits till the day is done. So go ahead and do April 3, or if you're if it's already April 5 when you watch this, do April 4. Say request download. This may take just a minute. You can keep refreshing the page, or for me, I have one that already exists. So I'm gonna go ahead and open this. I'm just gonna say download. It's gonna download a text file at the bottom of Chrome if you're using that or in your download section. Let's see if this uh, is done. It shouldn't take real long. It's not yet. I'm just gonna show you how to use the text file here. So open the text file, you'll, you'll see something like this. It'll have some headers. Grab everything except the headers. So you'll see that the headers go for about three lines there. Go ahead and grab where it says the year and just drag all the way down. There's not a much better way to grab this data. So you can do that. It's gonna be everything that you've disposed of over the last however many years you have. Drag that down, and once that's completed, we're gonna do Control C to copy it. Come back over here, and again, right where it says paste your disposals here, Control V, and this is just a bunch of text, but again, it's got your SKU, it's got the number of items that we removed, and it's got the fees. Um, some of you were fortunate and have some free removals like that. Others of you had to pay for some of them like this. Um, so it's actually done. So it'll actually up refresh the page for you. You can download the new one yourself. And then once you've done that, go ahead and click update data. It's gonna run a macro again, and then everything there should be accurate. Again, we still have the issue with the pivot table. Just ignore that. That should be the last of the data you need. Feel free to run it through its paces, and thanks again.